Hey guys, welcome to Farming Simulator 2015. By the sounds of it, that real peaked the mic. Oops. So, what are we doing today? We're going to carry on harvesting uh, a beautiful canola. We're not going to be selling any of it, we're just going to be stockpiling. And then, we may do a mix of barley, canola, in the fields. I'm not overly too sure. I want to kind of concentrate on some greenhouse stuff and the animal side of things on the Cobra. So we've got Bullpark. I, we know where we're going on Cobra and honestly having this wheel is really like... I've not played so much farm sim in the last month since having the steering wheel. It's crazy. So we have good news on uh, the headset. My Astro A40 TRs. I got an email today from. Uh, what button is it? To get this guy going. Not that one. Alright, let's bring up. Uh, I, sh I should be remembering these. Button full. Why didn't you switch on? Basically, the uh, guy got back to me. Uh, what we said at six. Let me take my headset down. Saying they were unable to find the fault, but they were sending me out a new USB cable and a new mix amp. I thought, well, that's awesome. Just didn't find it. So, is it a problem with the computer? <laughs> kind of got me worried. Um, I don't know what time those guys stay on late. It was a UK office, but they were still there. See when you message, message me, and he said he's found the fault. It was the mix amp. He was screwing around with the settings in a PS4 with the mix amp, and he got it to do exactly what it showed in the video. So it was a fault in that mix amp. That means awesome. So I'm hoping it will sound better. Obviously, it had issues. So the mic may sound a bit more clearer because although I thought the quality was better than this one, listening to the video back when I check out the audio and everything when I render it, this mic sounds clearer. It sounds more like I do in person. Where that mic sounded like I had a head cold and didn't sound like me at all. So I don't know. I, I really don't know. Maybe something like that. I may ask the support team about it. Ask, just put in the ticket. Not just a question more than anything. Maybe on the forums would be better than just putting in a support ticket. I don't know. I like the quality. Sound does sound better, but it's a really. It's a case of. I'm hoping it was just the mix amp and it was not giving the full clarity of the mic. The audio coming from it in the headphones just sounded phenomenal. That was awesome. It's just the mic I had a little bit of concern over. What field are we in anyway for? Probably won't need to empty the whole tank on this. Probably just motor along doing it. Yeah, then we've got field 2. Though. I think we've already got course set up in field 2. We are going to be seeing a lot of harvesting, so... hope you guys are prepared for that. If not, I apologise, but that's the way she's going to be. I want to do the, a lot of the harvesting myself. Look at those lines. Almost as bad as banking in last night's stream. I think Banky was on about streaming that tonight too, actually, Fishing Planet. I'm streaming again tonight, should I say, Fishing Planet. If uh, plans turn out correct, hopefully he sets up the stream better than he did yesterday. So, he'll make. There's no denying that. Yesterday's stream was not set up <laughs> at all. Poor guy. Screwed up on the side chat, and then his mic. Well, my mic wasn't coming through, then his mic wasn't coming through. Yeah, he had fun last night. Poor guy.
So a game that I'm going to be probably getting pretty soon is Fallout 4. I've not mentioned about it on my channel because, well, really until Banky and UK Daz mentioned about it, I was like, yeah, it's Fallout. What's so special? It looks a good game, actually. So I'm probably going to end up picking that up. One of these AAA titles that... One of the only AAA titles that I've actually seen that's coming out that I'm like, mm, that kind of is probably my playstyle right there. No multiplayer. Pure story mode. Where have games gone nowadays? Like, I don't know what it is now in Call of Duty, but from what I understand is <laughs> dick awful. Having story mode in there. Like, there they used to be a good storyline. I'm not... Obviously, I can't say for sure, because I don't play them. But they, they used to have a good storyline to it. And I think there's... With the new one, don't quote me on this, cause, uh, I think I heard on a video or someone say that you can just buy it as a multiplayer only. Uh, kind of blows. Really, it does. Actually, you know what? We may go into th Field 3. What's Field 3 got in it? We're right there. Uh, this one. Center of the camera again. And of course, with the mix amp, with my headset coming back, because it's been shipped. Yay! UPS, so it should be here pretty damn quick, actually. Hoping. I missed a bit. Pew Banky, actually, I missed quite a bit. There's some over there, too. Pew Banky, moaning. <laughs> See, you're not the only one. I'm not the only one, Shazzy. How much fuel we got on this, baby? Yeah, plenty of fuel. It's not really using a whole lot. So, apparently. Someone asked in Dagowin's videos about me and him doing a video together, and he apparently said if he wants. Well, I've yet to find out that. Find the comment. No one's. I can't remember who it mentioned about it, but it didn't say the video. So if you're watching this, let me know what video it is so I can go back and check it out. to talk to him on a team speak at some point. Because apparently every stream I get asked, when are you going to play with Dagoin? Are you going to play with Dagoin? Do you watch Dagoin? And then you get the odd ones. It says, uh, oh, it seems like you don't like Dagoin. I've gone nothing against Dagoin. Me and him have spoken to, me and him have spoken in the past. Why would I have anything against the girl? I don't know why people would say that, but heck, people like trying to get their wooden spoons out and in that big old crock pot stirring things up. Just to get some YouTube drama going when there isn't any YouTube drama. <laughs> Stupid. Sports. Don't think this field would fill up. This field is really useless. Uh, it's good to have nonetheless. And we are off. So I was talking to Ian Robson last night. He came on Team Speak. Pleasant surprise. Nice speaking to him. Always is. And he was saying about how much the steering wheel is over there in Canada. I about hit the floor once he told me. Over in Canada, believe it or not, the steering wheel costs, the steering wheel console pedals costs 400 freaking dollars. What are they thinking? You can pick up two G27 steering wheels for that. Uh, seriously? Are, are they, like, stupid? It's crazy to me. 
Now this may not be the plan. Yeah, I don't think so. Tell you one thing, these gate that gate would need to be made bigger. Oh, if I had anything to do with that farm. Okay, number four. Some crews. What do we have? Stin. Can I can I can I can I take it? Ain't happy. So where was I? Yeah, four hundred dollars. And uh, seriously, yeah, it's just mind blown. Is it worth four hundred dollars for if you're a Canadian citizen? How no? Just, just no. Get yourself a G27, and if you really want the console side panel, because really, when it comes down to it, that's what you want. The steering wheel. It's got two analog sticks, two D-pads, three buttons, when it comes down to it. Two on the back, one is your horn. There's your horn. I just don't see the point. And you've got actually real cheap pedals there. Ian. Made me feel very sad that the G27 steering and the pedals are actually weighted and are nice. Mm, not happy. Alright, uh, that's honestly, that's the only thing I don't like about this whole setup is those pedals are just cheesy. Very cheesy. But they'll do, I mean, I'll look after it. Some people aren't so careful with their pieces of equipment and they'll probably break. But that's them. I'd like more weight in there though, that's the problem. So I may at some point see if I can open it up and figure out if I could put any weight in there somehow without damaging anything, I doubt it, but yeah but you can get G27 for that two G27 for that so G27 would be the way to go, personally if the G27s were cheaper than the steering wheel combo over here I personally would have got a G27 and then bought the side console separately but they have not got the option to buy the side console separately over here yet that I find strange but it isn't available yet and with the G27s you're looking about 250 something in that ballpark pounds still and they're probably getting limited you could get used ones but personally just I'm not funny about this type of thing normally but when it comes down to peripherals for like that I would want brand new you don't know whose grubby hands have been all over and kind of do. What's that tank looking like? Yeah, we're going to have to get all the combat going. Whoa, jittery. Alright, let's... Start... There you are! That's starting to need more fuel too. Jeez. Why is everything so thirsty? Do we have a course for that? Let's check what we're cruising up here. We don't! Field 6, Field 5. Three. Uh, field 9. Oh dang. That's probably two big ones, isn't it? Six and nine, yeah, it is. Surprised I don't have one, so I need to go ahead and figure that out. Where is it? Well, it's probably actually almost full. Yeah. Pretty darn close. Another crop. Kind of tempted to put real terrain back in now I've got this wheel to add the bounciness and the bumps there's a John Deere that Recon was using on one of his streams over the weekend that's actually real good you can adjust the mirrors like the whole mirror plastic everything moves not just the image you see it's got cab suspension you bounce all over the place it feels like you're driving a real machine with an air ride seat. 
It's just got some small things that I'd love addressing, and that's one of which, although I'm not going to be looking at it often now on outside, is the rooms. They're definitely incorrect. They're from the stock machine. I should have just stayed down there. I really should have. Where the frick did you go? Oh, there you are. I found you. Oh, shush. It's Miss. Not bad. How close to the hedge am I? Probably very. Oh yeah, oh yeah. What's these lines looking like now? Yeah, it's tough. I wish they had like some dynamic hoses in the game where just a small looks feature and they would actually connect down into the solenoids of the, or the valves, whatever you want to call it. Instead of being up like that. And I don't mean just this trailer, I mean built into the game. Small thing, but functionality. Okay. Yeah, I should be okay there. We'll let it do its turn and then we'll uh, jump in and take control again. I do enjoy doing that. 17 minutes, pretty well. Time goes by when you have a fun. So it's today, Wednesday, so it'll be Thursday's video and perfect. We'll be wrapping up on uh, the Gold Edition map for, well, tomorrow, that'll be Thursday for Friday. And then live streaming with the wheel. wheel. may figure out how to do a wheel cam if it's so needed. I don't know yet. Uh, just, just getting the angle right. I've got the only way I can get a shot of this that I should be actually controlling this very well is from the right hand side of me. The left hand side is a wall. I like it. You hear the knocking. It's a cupboard there where our stairs are, so there's nothing that could be mounted there, there's no shelves or anything like that, so I can't do anything that way. Um, I want it facing forward at my desk, not facing back behind me, so you can see my messy room. That's probably going to be even messier come tomorrow because I'm going to have so many boxes. Alright, let's jump in. Let's kill that. And take yourself over. Five. Get rid of the feelers as well. I'll say. We'll see. That's why I've not released the review on it yet. It's doing well because I said I was going to do that and I kind of still want to do it. Whether I will actually now, I don't know. But We shall see. I may just wow use OBS to record that. Maybe the easiest way to do it, actually. <laughs> why didn't I think of that earlier? Tired, just you know, for some reason. Why? I do not know. 
we can't have that many fields to actually do. We forgot to do the, one of the biggest fields at uh, Oa. We got our sugar beet harvest though. If we need the money, we can take in. We should be okay. We may take some of the canola in. So we keep ourselves like a, around three grand, give or take. Now the Massey Ferguson that I've got, I'll be doing this off camera, but I'll be straight up replacing it with one that I found. I can't remember the website, but I think it's getting around there on some of the off-brand websites, as I call them. And that's the exact same machine, just with the front loader set up just what I wanted. And I believe they've got like a crude mid-hitch. And I know it's not functionally correct for it to have a mid-hitch. Oh, but just for game functionality, so many trailers on that thing would be able to pull it can't. So that'll add a big bonus. And of course there's some trailers I just straight up wouldn't be able to pull <laughs> in real life and the thing would probably pull them like a champ. Who knows? The thing I'm actually kinda of surprised on the FPS is looking at that, of course it's going down to thirty because of fraps. I've got it set it to record at thirty. So it won't go any lower in theory. I have just upgraded my uh, graphics drivers as well. Of course, Call of Duty is coming out soon, I think. I'm not sure when Black Ops comes out, so yeah. Probably this weekend, I don't know. I'll have to check. Is in the tank. Yeah, again on 50. Not too bad. Not too bad. I wish the field actually haven't done that. So I read in your comments about the inside and outside. Some of you want to mix, some of you like the cab, some of you don't. So I think I'll just try and mix it up. From time to time, you've got a long ways to go. Yeah, get there. So we may just start doing the ups and downs. No, I don't know. I think it really, when it comes down to harvesting and to the way you do it, it's down to the guy operating the combine. But doing it this way, your spout's always on the right side. It kind of makes sense to just go around in circles. I mean, is it affecting the crop? No, because the crop you're not really touching. See there were fertilized it and it screwed up on that one. Oh, that's another first person. Well, oh, third person. And for some reason my tablet's almost dead too. Just bringing that up because I use that. I have a stopwatch on there, so as soon as I hit my record button on fraps. Ooh dear. Since I hit my record button on fraps, I start the stopwatch so I know how long I've been going. On my second screen I've got Audacity so I can see that that's still recording and it actually is somewhat correct on the time that it's showing that we're at, but it's always like I leave a bit of dead zone right at the beginning. So I've been pretty lucky and now I've said that I'm probably going to screw it up royally in this video that I'll render tomorrow, but the sound syncing to what I'm doing in game is usually pretty darn close to almost spot on. Wonder why it wasn't often. Not at the Mars now. What percentage is that? 15. So it looks like I'll be putting that on charge. Or at least putting a little bit of juice in there. Now most people are charging most of my devices up at night. Oh, 
Oh, what do we have to focus on it? Yeah, we got to be in pretty full. Yep. There's the oil seed, right? Canola, right? Whatever you want to call it. OSR. It's what it is. So I think our final s episode on the Gold Edition map is probably going to be thri uh, Friday. Friday? No, Friday. What map are we going to be doing the live stream on? I don't know. Really don't know. Probably Holthausen. I would imagine. Bum ba dum. Email. Oh, I did it again. This is what I mean. I wish they set the uh, analog sticks and the D-pads further insets so you don't catch it with your hand, because most people are going to be using the palm of their hand to steer with. Unless they expected people to use the uh, ball, wheel, whatever you want to call it. I took it off. I, I don't have it on anymore. It's just a couple of screws that take that sucker off. And Right where I want to keep my hand is right where the analog sticks are, on the top bars are. That's how I'd probably do it in real life, so that's how my hand is now. That's how I have done it in real life on Bill's practice. But speaking of which, he's gone out and got himself a mini excavator now. <laughs> that thing looks so tiny. As soon as he got on it, of course I know Bill, I've seen him in person. I know the the size of the guy in height is what I'm referring to when I say that. So I know I can get a size comparison. And that thing's small. I think it looks more like a toy than a actual real machine. I'm kind of surprised. Oh, whiffle, whiffle, whiffle. Uh, I didn't concentrate on that at all, did I? Okay, what button is it? Ten. Yep, you can see the beam coming out of the uh, auger coming out in the mirror, you can see the shadow, and there it is. Perfect. Whereabouts is the combo anyway? Pretty sure we we're close to the edge over there. Take a nice leisurely drive. Sipping on some coffee. Yeah, don't think it was any quick going this way. Hit him out of there. It does not matter. Probably need to go empty this so that oh, after this one, so we'll probably get drive control. Not drive control. What am I on about? Auto combine in the mix. Depending if we've emptied it the whole way. We're getting close to ending the video anyway, so I may just go tip this and we'll probably call it. I don't know. I may end up finishing this field off off camera. Because, like I said, I've been enjoying using this wheel, I really have. Ooh, I wonder what the button is to actually cover it if you can. 
Use cover 16, but 16, where are you? There you are. I thought they fixed this. Dynamic fill, so it doesn't do that. That's worse than it ever was. Wow. I wonder if there's an update. That's bad. Wow. <laughs> Bumped up to about 50. Miles an hour. Yeah, we're time we get there and tipped, it'll probably be time to end the video, so we will call it. We'll just take a slow pace down. We don't need to be driving flat out. And our brains smashed about. And of course tomorrow, being Thursday, is the 5th of November. For those of you that are outside of the United Kingdom and you're not sure what's so special about the 5th of November, Okay, put it in. 5th November UK and it'll probably come up what it is. I think I've touched on it in the past. So we'll get right over and probably start on 10 now. Oh, really? See, that looked like I'd, that would have gone in. So right there I would have really done some good damage to the vehicle. But you don't get any depth perception, perception in the game. That's the problem I always run into. Saying why they're not tipping. Does that glitch through the top there? Oh yeah. Probably be okay if I was further forward. No, this doesn't need any diesel. For real life, you've actually got movement, and you can move your head to find out if you're in the good spot or not, stuff like that. Alrighty. Park that guy up, and 33. Yeah, let's finish off the video. Just start doing a bit more housing, maybe. So many buttons, so many buttons. And yeah, that spot that's over on the left that we just went by, we will pick that up, don't worry. I'm getting hungry too. Let's go worry about finding something to... Snack him. It's funny how they've duplicated the screens. You got one down at the bottom, you got one up at the top there. I don't know if the real ones are like that, I doubt it, unless there's two different screens for two different vitals. Like one's engine and the other's GPS or I don't know. Makes sense why they've done this. This is a modded combine too, so it is nice. Personally, I would have preferred the screen on the left hand side. But real life you obviously don't have the HUD, so it doesn't matter. So guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Harvesting more canola, stockpiling, some money. Gonna get into the cows real soon and the pigs and all that good stuff, so got a lot to look forward to in that respect. So guys, I hope you enjoyed and 
like always, I will catch you guys next time for another Farm Simulator video that will be on the final one of Gold Edition. So, hope you guys enjoyed. Catch you guys later. See ya.